continuation. Chance here for Peru. But good blocking. That's something that they are going to have to be. Confusion, I think uh, Robinson thought Gibbermeyer was going to play it. Another good dig. Oh, that was unlucky. Good reactions from Robinson. So to watch Robinson here. She goes up straight away. She's turning, looking. Nice speed in the middle. Easy was off. That's a good serve. Trying to uh, disrupt the USA's uh, hitting attack. But really great the opportunity. And then Kreklo says, OK, put that one away through the middle. Right. Peru have a point. And now they have an ace to go with it. And things end. It's now 12-15. Of course it though, gets the side out, so 16-12. And come back in with it. Either that or get into a position where you can play it early. 80. Rodimar, three blockers, and she's put it right into Gibemeyer. Not holding her position. That time though, Gibemeyer finds a gap. The speed of that ball laterally, no chance at all. Udebe has to play it. Olimar again, better chance now and finds the line. That's a nice swing. But here, USA thought cross court again, but look, nice amount of line for her to turn and the Which teams are you supporting? What do you think about the uh, volleyball so far? Who do you want to win? Who's your favourite player? Set from La Rosa Miles off the net to the middle, who wasn't able to get a swing on it. Easy will. Well, that's a great block. Uribe. Bay. So high, wide, out to force it. Down goes the ball. Good swing. Dixon hammers that one. Apologised for the head. This time, USA were ganging up on Ortiz. Eight. ...about what they're doing and why things are happening. And then it just helps to, in, to again and recognise exactly what you're seeing in front of you and why you're doing what you're doing blockers or if it's the outside hitter if they are pinch blocking or the outside hitter happens to be right in front just like we saw in set one good serve from Fawcett good jump dropped in front of her watch 15 going back off balance right through the heels to win so this is exactly what Karaj Karai wanted and which means they don't have Anything other than perhaps one option. Hegeland was uh, turned by the ball. She'll be disappointed with was facing back to the net. Didn't get her left shoulder under her right to play that. Silibero takes it away from her. The combination play, well dealt with by Fawcett. Nice, easy with the cut to the line. Barossa. Oh, loads of room. Substitution by Peru. Just about enough room for Lies yes, to. Block out from Robinson, gets the job done for the USA, 25-15. Good blocking, Gibbermeyer puts it down. Gone. Good work, good chase as well, Kreklo next to force it, able to get the ball back in play. Well, that one won't come back because Gibbermeyer and Robinson are on the same situation.
out to good serve. Force has definitely been the best server for jump float serve deep into the corner. Ortiz having to cover behind Olmar. Solid blocking. It's the outside hitter's movement and then the middle block comes to close the gap. She's done that brilliantly actually. That's Swing from Fawcett. Look at the Barrow for the USA. Another good swing from Fawcett, not seen very nicely. So, glass being front row. Again, the block holds fast for the case of everyone's in too close and expecting someone else to play it. Watch what's happening on the side of the USA if you can, where their movement is. Ace serve from Craig Close here. Get the chance. Perfect serve. And it's a block to finish things off. Robinson puts the ball down. And the USA take the match by three sets to nothing.